Hey guys, what's up? Sora here with more Road to Evo 2016 videos. I am up against a geef whose name is Corrupt Combos. Um, I don't know if I know this guy. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. But uh, geef is definitely one of those interesting matchups for Karen. It's a matter of whiff punishing with this man. Like that. Ugh, I should have held that back. Ooh, wow. What was that for? Hit I thought he was gonna flex again, that's why I went then. Ah! <laughs> no punish, so I wanted to try that at least once to set. I'm waiting for the V trigger to be honest with you. Um, maybe I'll jump in when, as soon as he does the punch. If he does it. Should've went for back grab. So, at that range that nothing would have hit even though it was negative, he was trying to punish a limb that was no longer there. It's only minus two. With the uh, crouching medium kick. Plus two, because he back rolled. Just so you guys know. Whoops, sorry. See how graceful that was? <laughs> oh, this guy with the call out. He doesn't want it. He doesn't want it. Okay, nice. Oh, I wish I would have punished that. Yes. There was, there was an OS there that I could have placed, but I'm practicing that tomorrow, not today. Woo! Wait. It's never over against Steve. It is never, never over against Steve. <laughs> Way! Yeah, he can win. <laughs> he actually made the right read, um, which is a shame. He made the right read when he went for. Um... Darn it, what did he go for? He made the right read somewhere where I should have lost. Um, but then he didn't punish the forward jump. So, yeah, that, that, that was where he. Unfortunately failed, but that was good hustle on his part. Round one. Um, yeah, it's never ever over against a geef. That's the... Don't bother, take the jab. Take the jab, I'll gladly trade jab or V-Scale. Or v -mute. I won't trade it for that, but yeah. I thought he was gonna react to my button with um. Nice. Back dash. 
Oh wait, he doesn't have like the oh my god. This man! <laughs> Nope, 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 nope. I'll gladly take those. Yeah, I thought that would reach. That's why I went for it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, he doesn't really have to do anything. I don't know why he's trying to wait. Oh my gosh. Um. Probably should have went for j jump forward. I think jump forward would have been good there. I c tried to confirm the. Uh, Crush counter that never came. We didn't learn from that. Plus two. Okay, there it is. Three, three. Ah, uh, woo! This matchup, this matchup is exhausting. Cause you have to. It's not like Dalsim or or it's not like um. It's one of those matches where you have to play almost perfect. Uh, Try to go for a safe point. <laughs> Try to punish the beast. But <laughs> there it is. Plus sir. <laughs> I thought he would do it again. Oh my god, running bear grab against that. The struggle that this character has um, <laughs> against Karen is ay 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 that was that was good that was good I think I will have dinner after that match that was a godlike match I love it I definitely did mistakes that last V trigger I did the uncharged V trigger there was no reason why I should have done that um, I should have whiffed with with some jabs with some normals. Try to see whether he would react with Visco or not. Um, what else? Uh, the thing I did right was definitely taking the jabs over taking the potential command command throw. So when you place the Visco right and you backdash, all he can get really is jab, um, and you'll recover in the air, so he really can't get too much off that. So better to take that than the Oki off, um, or even the damage of. A spinning pile driver. It's when Karen is low life that that becomes a true guessing game of what you will do. But the reason why Zangief is low tier is because he only has that. He only has jab as his tool. So if he's using that as a as a defense as a defense mechanism, he doesn't really get anything off it because um, uh, the universal answer to command throw is backdash. The universal answer to throw is backdash. So unless he puts me in a plus in the place where he's plus then I'd rather take the hit off the backdash backdash considers me airborne so I recover in the air then I backdash I'm out see and I build, I build V-trigger along the way which in that case I think I won two matches because I had V-trigger the third the last match I won pseudo because I had V-trigger because he was worried about V-trigger the entire time um, but yeah that's uh, oh speaking of V-trigger the one other mistake I went I think I did there was going for the um, 
the overhead at the end. That's very gimmicky. Number one. Number two, he could have punished with SPD. <laughs> um, wait. No, EX SPD is three. Uh, I forgot how many frames EX SPD is. I, hmm. I'll have to look that up, but it's minus. Huh. I don't know the frames of Rekka of the overhead. I'll post it in the video below or in the in the video description below of what the frames are on Rekka into overhead on block as well as the startup frames for um, EX command grab so that you guys or EX uh, SVD so you guys know exactly how that interaction works. Long story short, I do think that he could have punished me with EX SPD if he had wanted and that would have either resulted in him in the round or at the very least a really good Oki. That's when Crouch Jab <laughs> becomes uh, really, really scary. But with that being said, thank you guys for watching. I need to eat dinner. <laughs> I'll catch you guys later. Hope you guys are excited about Ibuki and Balg as I am. I will be posting up videos, either story mode or something related to that to those uh to that update that's coming up really soon so thank you guys peace